Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Libra? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, whenever you come across this reading. Libra, I hope everyone is staying safe. I love you guys. I love you guys. Please take what resonates and leave the rest to someone else. I want to say, please be very vigilant. I've already posted be very vigilant of scammers. Libra, for my OGs, my newies, and my, my recentlies, however, you, you, know, I be, you know, I do not do personal readings. And I would not never give you a phone number. So please be very vigilant. I don't care if my picture is right there beside the, beside the comment. That is a scam. OK, if I decide when I'm going to do personal readings, I promise you, I will go live about it. You will hear it from my mouth. So I love you guys. Libra, you requested a reading. And the reason why I don't do a lot of the other signs, because if I don't have I, I operate from from energy. OK, and if I only have 50 people that's watching Libra or or something like that, because sometimes I do all the signs. If I'm not getting a lot of energy, uh, Libra, then I won't do the signs. So, um, you know, I'll do it every once in a while, but I won't do it a lot. OK, I have to like you request it. Uh, a few of you request it. So let's see what's in your energy. Spirit guides, divine universe. This is for Libra. Okay. Well, Libra. So your energy, all these cards came out. You're about to come out of, re out of this financial constraint. I feel like some of you have been in a financial constraint. I see doors that are ab about to start opening for you. I feel like your money is about to start to flow. Okay. You're about to start to, uh, uh, maybe getting different streams of income. All right. You're getting out of this. OK, so that is a beautiful thing. I also feel as though that um, this is a new cycle. I feel like your old cycle was consist of really, you know, not it's been hard making ends meet. But you're coming out of that. You see the moon here. Uh, the world card is all about ending old cycles and starting new cycles. OK, so your new cycle is that your doors are about to start. Money is a start is about to start flowing in your life. OK, uh, uh, some of you may um, let me fix the camera. OK, some of you may, um, uh, you know, just start having different streams of income coming. But um I also the indecision card came out in reverse in your energy, which tells me that at one point in time, you were your, your back was up, up against the wall, which tells me that you, you were, you, you know, you didn't know which way to go. So I feel like this stream of income is coming from the community. And when, when it says the community, I feel like somebody that you know, that somebody knows that they know that they know it's going to help you. Okay. That's where you're going to start getting your clientele. If you're doing, if, if you're in, uh, starting a business or if your business hadn't been right, it's going to be somebody that you know, that they know, and you all, you know, it, that's how it's going to go. It's going to go in threes. It's going to go in a domino's effect. Okay. So this new cycle is bringing you abundance. Uh, you're coming out of it. Just hang on. I know it's been pretty tight. Okay. I, I get it. Let's see what your affirmation is. Spirit guys, this is for Libra. What is Libra's affirmation? Affirmation for Libra. Thank you, spirit guys. Affirmation. Affirmation. Thank you. Your purpose. Okay. The first card that came out, Libra, is purpose. I wake each morning. I wake each morning serving my life's purpose and thinking of creative ways that I can take inspired actions towards my heart's desire. A lot of you are in your purpose. A lot of you have figured out what your purpose is, what it is that you want to do. Um, or are you trying to, you know, you've really been having your thinking cap on as well. Flexibility. So, um, the card flexibility is telling me I live each day of my life with flexibility, allowing the universe to open up doors and opportunities. So with this uh, a stream of income, this this money that is 
taking you out of this, you know, this financial constraint, Libra, um, it's going to allow you, you're going to have a lot of flexibility. And I feel like what it is that you're going to be doing or whatever it is that your purpose is, you're going to enjoy this. Whether this is your having your own business, whatever you're doing, you're going to be flex. It's going to be flexible. It, it, it's like you're going to have the right hours. You're going to, you're going to probably be able to maneuver your own hours. That's what business is the stream of income you have in, you know, um, you got people that's going to want to help you. You're going to have people that's going to, you know, it's going to be a dominoes is somebody that knows somebody that knows somebody. And this is what your new cycle is going to look like. And at the bottom of the card is a synchronicity. Libra, if you're starting to see some synchronicity, some numbers, some signs, different numbers, a lot of repeating numbers, then you know that, uh, 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 these doors, things are about to change in your life. Okay. Uh, just keep the confidence It's behind this card. It's saying, keep your confidence, keep walking in your confidence. I have confidence in all that I do and in, in all areas of my life. Okay. So keep your confidence. I know sometimes it can be, you can feel a little down, you can feel a little low, but <clears throat> And spirit guys say, just keep that confidence, keep the faith, keep believing because things are about to change. You got the world here. Okay. The darkness is over. That cycle is about to end. You're about, look at here. I, I, I can't make this up. You're coming out of this financial constraint and spirit guys is opening, pushing, pushing open doors that your money is going to flow and you're going to have streams of income and you're going, and I feel like this is going to be your purpose, what you want. OK, so that's that's your um, affirmation. Let's see what the stars have for you, Libra. Let's see what's in the stars. Thank you, spirit, guys, divine universe ancestors with high vibration as you come into this reading for. OK, those two cards just came out. So the first one is the way is clear, Libra. It says awaken to the power within you. Spirit is giving you the okay. Everything is clear. You have done your work. The stars, everything is aligned. Everything is where it's supposed to be. And also spirit guys is saying your divine, whoever you believe in, be clear on what you want. Put action to your goals and make them a reality. Okay. Uh, spirit guys, you know, whatever you're thinking, sometimes it's good to write down the very things that you want. Or if you praying to God, divine universe, your ancestors will have vibration, whoever you praying to or whoever you're asking for help, be very clear because spirit guys is saying the way is clear. Y your path is clear. You, it's like, okay, uh, you can go. OK, you can you can you can start this chapter, but be very clear and put action. OK, put action, you know, into what it is that you want. OK, uh, just don't say it. Just don't talk about it, but do it. All right. All right. Spirit, guys, the bottom of the car, that's too many. The bottom of the deck. Let's see. Re okay, that card came out again. Spirit God wanted it. Remember, love is the key, Libra. Love what you have in your life right now. Okay, Spirit Guys is saying, don't forget to love what you have in your life because sometimes we can take that for granted. Sometimes we can just, you know, think that, oh, nothing's going to happen or it's all right. But Spirit Guys is saying, love what you have in your life right now. In other words, be grateful, be thankful. Um, also, uh, appreciate what you have in your life right now. Because if you think about it, uh, uh, some people don't have what you may have, okay? but uh, miracles are about to happen in your life. Okay. Love what you have right now. This was right behind that card. Miracles is about to happen. Okay. Do you believe in miracles? Do you believe that things happen and, and you, 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 you're going to be like, I know this was from God, divine universe, whoever you believe in miracles happen every day. 
every day. You understand? It says, give the universe your clear intentions. I have this card three times in here. Your clear intentions, whatever you're trying to manifest, Libra. Spirit guides want you to give your clear intentions. Okay, right here, say, put action into what you want. Don't just talk about it, be about it. Okay, but miracles are about to happen. Remember, love is the key. And love and appreciate what you have in your life right now. Because, honey, let me tell you something. Never doubt the universe, God, whoever you believe in. Because miracles happen every single day. Okay? But just remember. Remember the silver lining to this all, Libra. Is that love what you have in your life right now. Be grateful. Be thankful. Even if you did not. Even if you don't have but a dime in your pocket. Because see how, how it can change overnight. Just be grateful and thankful for the things that you have. Because it's about to multiply. It's about to definitely multiply in your life. Okay. So miracles are about to happen. Get ready. So let's see uh, what's in the moon. We just seen the stars. We just had your affirmation. We, we poured your energy. Now let's see what the moonology says. Spirit guys, this is for Libra. The moonology for Libra. Thank you. Assess the situation. You may have Virgo in your chart. Look at your situation. Look at what caused this financial constraint. Okay. And always and, and try to do better. Because you know, when you know better, when you know better, you do better. You know, just reflect back on your life and just see, okay, what caused me to be in that 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 con uh um that financial constraint is it because uh you procrastinate you didn't really put your your words into action or you you didn't you didn't act out or you didn't have a clear vision or you was really your mind was over over clouded okay and um spirit guys want you to assess the situation thank you spirit another card thank you uh and go for it <laughs> you may have a reason your chart Libra go for it spirit guys is saying go for it baby okay go for it and at the bottom of the deck is find balance make sure you have balance between your life and your purpose, your purpose, your business, your whatever it is, and your life. Okay, you got to make sure you maintain balance. And the card that's behind that is embrace the flow of your life. Like Spirit Guy said, be clear what you want. Put actions and goals. It also says, you know, love where you at and be grateful and thankful. But make sure you find balance and embrace. Embrace the flow of life. Embra embrace yourself. Embrace the moment. Be grateful. Okay. That's what Spirit Guys is saying. Okay. So let's see what your reading is all about. Now that I have the cards all in everywhere. Okay. Did I tell y'all I love you guys? I love you guys. I do. I do. Spirit Guys, this is for Libra. What is the reading? What is it that Libra needs to know? Okay. I've already pre-shuffled sure the cards, Libra. Let's see what spirit guides, divine universe, ancestors with high vibrations, Arch, Archangel Michael, Gabriel, Ariel, please come into this reading. Thank you. What is the message you have for my Libras? All right. Let's see what we got going on. Spirit guides, tell me what it is. Oh. So it looks like, let me tell you something. It looks like it took a long time. You haven't been stable for a long time. It has taken some time. I feel like you've been penny pinching, penny pinching. You have the, the knight of pentacles and you can have, have the king of pentacles in reverse, which tells me your stability. You haven't been stable, which caused this <clears throat> financial constraint. It's all about your money here. Okay. It's all about your money. This is a financial reading for somebody. It's all about your money. But see, look at here. You have persevered. The queen of pentacles or the king. The queen of pentacles is here. Even though the king of pentacles is in the reverse here, that is where you didn't have any stability. And, and you, you had it hard. You know, it took some time. You haven't been stabled in a very long time. You have not had maybe a stable job in a very long time. But look at here. You got the queen of pentacles here. You, have, you are persevering through this financial constraint, through this dark place that you were in.
and you are about to have the pinnacles in your lap. You're going to be unbothered. You're going to be secured because look at the money that's sitting. Look at the pinnacles you're holding. Whether you are a male or a female, it doesn't matter. It's all energy. But you're going to be in a head space of unbothered because you have persevered. Okay. Some miracles is about to happen in your life. You're going to have a lot of options, baby. The seven of cups, you're going to be able to any, many, many mode touch up mm, by it. So if you holler, let them mm, any, many, many mode, you're going to have options. Okay. You're going to be able to pay your bills to do everything that you know, to pay all your bills and, and, and get what you want. And whatever you want. Miracles are about to happen in your life. You have been stressed out, worried. I get it. Spirit guides, tell me more for Libra. Okay. So uh, you have the Ace of Wands. Something you're very passionate about. Something that a lot of you are doing. You're stepping into your passion, your purpose, your passion, your in inner knowing. Uh, it's on fire. Okay. And um, you had to do a lot of mirror work. You had to do a lot of looking at yourself. Yeah, here it is. You, The eight of wands. You had to do a lot of mirror work. I feel like that's where your dark place was, your shadow work. You had to really look at yourself. You know, sometimes, you know, people can tell us all the time how we are. But until we take a look in that, you couldn't you couldn't face yourself for a while. OK, that's where the dark energy, this dark energy was at because you were you were having you were just confined you was you your hands were tied your finances wasn't doing right nothing was going right you were in a dark place you had a hard time accepting that you were your own problem that's why spirit guys is saying uh it's good to assess the situation look at it and move forward and better it put it into action so you were definitely uh, a lot was up against you. You know, I also feel as though that a lot of you have get are getting have healed from a, a lot of hurt and pain, uh, maybe a relationship. OK, uh, you definitely went through a lot with a Gemini Libra Aquarius, possibly, but um, you definitely are doing a lot of healing. OK, Libra spirit guys. Yeah, I feel like you released the devil in reverse. You release. <clears throat> Maybe some toxic behaviors you were doing or you released this toxic relationship. Okay. Uh, Capricorn. Any other message for uh, my Libra? Any other financial message? This one. Okay. Look at here. So no more penny pinching. The card came out in reverse. This way you penny pinch. You hold on to your money tight. But it came out in reverse, honey. You ain't going to have to hold on to your money tight no more. Your miracles is about to happen in your life. New birth, Empress, honey. Let me tell you something. You have birth. You you're birthing. Some of you may get may be getting ready to have a, a child, okay? Uh, but you're the Empress or the Emperor. You're starting a new beginning in your life, okay? You are you are definitely birthing newness, like a brand new car. How you that that, that brand new house? You're definitely birthing something new out with the old, in with the new. So get ready because miracles happen every day. Every day. You hear me? Every day. You're going to get that house. Are you conquering uh, the, the uh, uh, four of wands? All right. Conquering. Some of you going to get married or whatever, however. But this is uh, the four of wands. <laughs> and justice is in your favor. Libra, you just showed up in your own reading. You're finally beginning to be balanced out in your life. Things are happening. Miracles are happening. Your money is right. Everything is, is, is going in your favor. This is good karma. You, you definitely have pulled yourself out of this financial constraint. A lot of miracles. A lot of uh, doors are opening. And you showed up in your reading. No better than that. Trust and believe you are on your way of not having to worry about anything. I'm Positive Thoughts, the Energy Libra. Until next time.